right, welcome back. It's your boy Jay, aka the Murder Whistle. My co pilot is here with me. Today we're watching the winner of our most recent poll. The name of this poll is Jay just got to his new apartment. This poll had Last Action Hero, Roadhouse, Arrival, and um, Kung Fu Panda on it. I ain't gonna lie, I'm kind of super excited to watch this because it got Robert Williams in it. Other than that, I don't know anything else about Gumanji. Before we get into it, I need y'all to like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps the channel out. Don't forget to check out the Patreon. You get early access to all my full of YouTube videos. You get access to exclusive TV shows and movies. You get access to a weekly poll to help decide what I watch on Fridays, like this one. And you get access to a um, weekly vlog that I've been doing over there. Also, don't forget to check us out on social media. Now, you're done all that. Now that you've done all that, I'm ready to get into this. So I'll see you on the other side. Let's get it. Don't worry, it's just a pack of wolves. Come on, we're almost rid of it. Don't worry, it's just a pack of wolves. That's a wild sentence. What if someone digs it up? May God have mercy on his soul. What are we digging up? What fuck? What are we burying? Is that like a heartbeat or like tribal drums? All yours, Alan. A dope ass car that went by. He flying on that bike, ain't he? Like, don't nobody see him getting chased? My baby. Good, Paris. Good to daddy. We'll be waiting. <sighs> he need to put some rocks in his pocket or something. I ain't gonna, like, I'm not gonna run for bullies. Hey, Alan, my man. I gotta show you something. Come here. Now I've been working on this for almost a year. Go ahead, take it. That is a Charles Barkley show. Do you think you'll like it? Shut the f up. That's David Allen Greer. If I can get Will Chamberlain to wear them, I predict there'll be a pair of those in every closet in America. Bro, them is the Barkleys. Is Billy Jessup picking on you again? Son, you're gonna have to face him sooner or later. Look. If you're afraid of something, you've got to stand and face it. Now run on, son. Oh, uh, what was it you wanted to show me? Just a minute, sir. Man, I can't believe David Allen Greer's in this bitch. What the devil? I haven't seen him since, like, Blank Man. Yeah. Yeah. Who did this? Well? He did it. I did, sir. Get him! Yeah. 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 Okay, I've got his bike! Jerks! If you were gonna take my bike, why didn't you just take it while I was in the place? Shut the f up. If dad just let him get beat up, See, I'll be out there Spartan kicking little kids. I'm telling you, straight like Leonidas. <laughs> I mean, how many times they hear him to do all that now that I'm thinking about it? Because he got, what, two black eyes and a busted lip? Did he just swing once? Nobody see this little boy doing anything? Where are the adults? Got one, he didn't say he just looking. Like he didn't even question why this mother was locked up in the case. Or nothing like that. He didn't he didn't even question it. He just 
unlocked it and brought it home. Neat. Got magnets in it. We have to talk to Alan. I would hate to grow up in that house. There. Congratulations, sweetheart. Mm. You don't want me living here anymore? It's always been the plan that you go to Cliffside when you were ready. Yeah. That's I won't want to do that either. Maybe I don't want to be who you are. Maybe I don't even want to be a parish. You won't be. Not till you start acting like one. Sick. Get your coat. See, I don't even like people like that. I don't want to hear another word about it! You won't! I'm never talking to you again! This little boy about to run away from home. Don't. Sam. What? Nothing. Just... Sam's abusive. I tell you. At least he was smart enough to take a snack with him. What are you doing here? I brought your bike back. You didn't have to. And she tall as f ain't she? Jumanji. A game for those who seek to find. I quit playing board games five years ago. My fault, little bougie. Sarah. Ain't no fing way. At night they fly. You better run. These winged things are not much fun. Why do I want to leave my world behind to go to some work? <gasps> what was that? I, I don't know. Put it away, Alan. <laughs> oh no. The game thinks I rolled. What do you mean the game thinks? I set this bitch on fire so fast. In the jungle, you must wait until the dice read five or eight. They would take me to that damn little school for boys in the morning. Because when they get back, it'll be a fire outside. Ah! Oh, f ah! Ain't no f way. Like, this is a trash board game. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? One person got sucked in the game. The other person getting attacked by bats. 26 years later. Shut the f*** up. Are you telling me that little boy got sucked in that game for 26 years? I'm sure you and your kids are going to be very happy here. Actually, they're my late brothers. Is this something or what? It sure is. Hey, my man went lying though. He said, I'm never gonna talk to you again. He was not lying. Is it big enough for you? Peter hasn't spoken a word since it happened. Oh my. I'm so sorry. Damn. How terribly awful. It's okay. That's sad as fuck. Skiing in San Moritz, gambling in Monte Carlo. Safariing. We barely even knew our parents. They were always away. We didn't even know if they loved us. But when the Sheik's yacht went down, well... That person did it! They managed to write us a really beautiful goodbye note that was found floating in a champagne bottle amongst the debris. <gasps> Excuse me. That little girl lied, ain't she? They were very devoted parents. It was a car crash in Canada. So you sent me those escrow papers? I wanna know what happened to the daddy too. I hope he felt like shit. That mustache is strong, boy. Is that one of them bats or that's just like a regular bat? Ah! I see he I see he can speak. What? What is it? I'm going to Motel 6. Oh, for heaven's sake. Hey. <laughs> that must he ain't talked since the accident, but as soon as some happened, he yelled. And he knows. That little boy got sense. <laughs> Did the house just laugh at him? That's aren't what I'd worry about in this house anyways. 
What do you worry about? I wouldn't want to live in a house where someone was murdered. Why would he tell Kiev that? I say his father did it. There's a thousand and one places he could have hid the body in this house. Especially if he chopped it up first. He f***ed up. He f***ed up for telling some kids that. There is nothing to be afraid of in this house. He just said ghosts live here. Did you hear anything a little while ago? Do you miss mom and dad? See? No. Liar. Well, she might have been lying when she said he did. If you don't cut that out, they're going to send you to a string. Uh huh. Do you think they're going to send you if you don't start talking? Okay, yeah. So maybe he just talked to her again. School bus should be here any minute. You guys still have your house keys? Oh, I thought she heard that too. Can only kids hear it? Hello? What? Please be good today. Why can only little kids hear it? <laughs> Shut up. No piece is still in the same damn places. Roll the dice to move your token. Doubles get another turn. The first player to reach the end wins. It's got to be microchips or something. Nah, folks, that's Satan. You go first. Hell no. He's smart though. He's seen some weird shit happen. Like you go first. You don't die. I try. It. I'm telling you, ain't no way. Tiny bike can make you itch, make you sneeze, make you twitch. Shut up! That's some things I've missed. Ah! And you want to sit back down at the game? Little girl, you're too smart for that. What are you doing? Maybe that little boy ain't smart. This will not be an easy mission. Monkeys slow the expedition. Shut the f up. Oh. Y'all aren't gonna beat y'all's ass. I promise you, I will go get on the bus. I would come home like, hey, I ain't a about it. The instructions say if we finish the game, it'll all go away. We better do it or Aunt Nora's gonna pitch a fit. We should just get through it quickly. I mean, there's no skill involved. We just had demon mosquitoes and monkeys show up. What the fuck are you talking about? There's no skill. There is demons involved. His fangs are sharp. He likes your taste. Your party better move post haste. I don't like the sound of that. Oh, Judy, someone's in here. <gasps> Y'all better get ate by Mufasa. It's not real, Peter. It's a hallucination. Yo, keep saying that when you're in a part of the circle of life. <laughs> Shut the f up. Oh my god, man. He looked like the great value crocodile hunter. That's a, hey, that's a mean ass beard, though. Did he smell them? Is he Tarzan? Hey man, Robert Williams is so hairy, man. He looked like he got a tan. Shut the f up. That's that little boy, ain't it? Somebody roll a five or an eight. He did. Ah! <laughs> <laughs>
thank you, 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 thank you. Thank you. Sorry if I scared you. I'm back, mom, dad. Bro, they are gone, bro. They are gone, folk. You are thirty. I'm home. I'm back. Matter of fact, you're probably my age. Who are you? We live here now. Where's my mom and dad? Gone, folk? Everyone thought you were dead. Man, look at that beard, though. Give me that description again. Shut the f*** up. He's a cop now. What year is it? Uh, 1995, remember? You got some ID? Oh, let me guess, you probably left it in the other Tarzan outfit, right? 26 years. Are you from around here? I was. You don't recognize him? He's our uncle. Does he always dress like that? Well, yeah, he's a vegetarian. The monkey's about to rob him. They gone, folk. My man came back looking like Captain Caveman. And he looking at people like they strange. Wait. Hey, man, it's time to turn to Detroit, ain't it? And look how hairy this man is, man. My dad used to make shoes here. They were the best shoes in New England. Hey! Uh, uh. He's fast as hell. S sorry. Easy, girl. It's a puppy. Why would they close Paris shoes? When his kid ran away, Sam put everything he had into trying to find him. His time, his money. After a while, he stopped coming to work. He just quit caring. I don't think anybody loved his boy more than Sam did. Parrish is still around? I see him now and then. They're over on Adams Street. What him over on Adams Street? What him? Shut the f up. I ain't gonna lie to you. When he said they're over on Adams Street, I thought they was homeless. Like, I didn't know they was dead. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I thought they was legit homeless. Our parents are dead, too. They were in the Middle East negotiating peace. Hey, that little girl lie about everything, don't she? I know you're upset and all, but I kind of feel we should finish the game. Why do you need me? Well, that... What do I look like, a ringling brother? Yes. No, it looks like another one of those weird bites. Weird bites. The, oh, the, um, the, um... Yeah, it's another one, all right. Jeez, it's over 50. What the hell's going on? The mosquito thingies. You hear that? Nah, bro. What do we hear? What came out of the game before me? The lion, a bunch of monkeys, and um... Ah! <laughs> it's okay. It's just a bug. But we're safe in here. We're fine. <laughs> ah! We're safe. Ethan, you want to bet? Oh, he's f***ing up. Piece of cake. <laughs> hey, bro, quit worrying about all that. We gotta st stop this damn game. Alan. Keep that thing away from me! I hope you realize that my parents are gone. This home belongs to me. Nah, dog, I don't think that's how that works. What do you think those monkeys are going to do to the ecosystem around here? Just sit right back in your hair. Hello? I bet he f***ed that bathroom up. <laughs> My man is in there chilling. What happened to you? You shaved with a piece of glass? What happened to you? The Clampets have a yard sale? What do you want? I've never shaved before. Man, he did pretty good for a first time shave. He's not gonna help us. He's afraid. What did you say? He called you out. He said you're afraid. 
Whatever it is, we'll handle it by ourselves. We don't need your help. I don't think so. Hey, bro, you can't grab little kids like that. I've seen things you've only seen in your nightmares. You don't even know what afraid is. You will not last five minutes without me. But then bring your ass in the living room, let's play this game. You're gonna help us? That's what it sounds like. Alan, ready? There is no ready. So, won't they need that other little girl? Because there's four pieces on the board? Or do just one person have to finish? He got double, so he gotta go again. Alan, it's not working. He wrote Snake Eyes last time. You're playing the game I started in 1969. So they do need that little girl. Whose turn is it? Sarah Whittle. Still in my sad house. We're looking for someone who used to live here. No, I've lived here my whole life. Then you must have Sarah Whittle. Is that the one from Jerry Maguire? 26 years ago, you played a game with a little boy down the street. A game of drums. You know that. That's the woman from Jerry Maguire. That's, um, I cannot think of her name. I don't know if I even know her real name. Alan. Got the f up. Leave a message and the doctor will call you back. And oh, he kidnapped her. While we're waiting. Whoa! God! Sarah, Sarah. No, no, no! See, what happened to you was so awful. I made up that Sarah, 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 it was oh, awful. It was awful. It was awful. It really was. Hey, that's hilarious. No, no, no. It wasn't real, Alan. Your father murdered you and he chopped you. <laughs> Come on. My dad did that. I mean, I'd have bleed it. That mean mother I'd, I'd, I'd have bleed it. We're going to finish it. And guess what? Your turn. Hey, Sarah stressed the f out. Just give me the dice, and you can go home. You don't have to play. <gasps> oh, my God! How could you do that? That is getting petty. They grow much faster than bamboo. Take care, or they'll come after you. Oh, great. Oh, God. Tell me this isn't happening. Oh, it is. Mm -hmm. Don't touch the purple ones. They shoot poisonous barbs. <laughs> Hey, it's not the f out that little boy. Oh, it's like I got a out of Seymour. Little shop of horse. No. Seymour's the dude who fed him. Y'all know who the f I'm talking about. That's just nasty. It looked like a bow. That was nasty. Oh my god! He's still running around. I forgot he was in the movie. Hey, State Farm gonna be popping in the morning, boy. Anybody up for iced tea? I'm gonna make some tea. Alan, please, last time I played this game, it ruined my life. It ruined your life? I mean, you know, he has a valid point of anything he's about to say. For 26 years, Sarah. He has a valid point. Because I'll be like, bitch, do you not know what I've been through? I came back in a jungle thong. I'm telling you, he, he was a whole lot nicer than I was. I'd have said all kinds of shit. A hunter from the darkest wild. Makes you feel just like a child. What is it? Yeah, what is it? Scott Van Pelt from ESPN. You miserable coward! Come back and face me like a man. Hey, bro, he came in blasting. Coming for the unlock. Is that his movie? Hey, man, what kind of cannons is this man shooting? Hey, you! Drop your gun and get your. 
your hands in the air! I mean, you better leave that man alone. He got that Uli walk. Bruh. Let it go, bruh. You got them Danny Glover knees. I see the reason you didn't want to play. Oh, you didn't want to play either? Mister, we started something 26 years ago, and now we got to finish it? Oh, my God. Shut up. I know what I said. Don't throw it back in my face. Shut up. Come on, Madam Serena. Why don't you just... dig in the lower reaches of your higher consciousness just... and find the memory of... Hey, they are having a couple argument, and they're not even together. Steal your bicycle? No, the big kid who probably took you to the movies... Don't be so fooled. It isn't thunder. Game. Staying oh, put would be a blunder. No, you're immature. You are. No, you're the one. I know. Like, y'all not gonna tell him what he said? Like, it said stay and put some blunder. I wouldn't be sitting there. Run! It's a game! <laughs> hey, why would they send a stampede after you? They're f***ed up! That's funny as hell. They got those in there. Not the game! Oh. Y'all had one job. I shall need a replacement weapon. Well, there's a waiting period. Or I could fill these out. <laughs> now anyone asks, you didn't get this here. Oh, sh Hey, he dropped that gold down. He's like, I can feel these out. Yeah. Hey, Peter a bad man, ain't he? And my man really come back just with that. I don't know what kind of gun that is. It's got a scope, a sound, <laughs> a damn drum on it. That's a Detroit special right there. He sniffed his wall. Hey! Hide the game. All right, I'm taking you in for questions. I'm not going anywhere. Oh, oh. Uh, just, uh, just, yeah. Now how are we supposed to finish the game? We can't. We can't finish it without him. Judy! I thought I could end the game myself. I was only ten spaces away. For every good thing this little boy do, he'd do something stupid. You tried to cheat? No, I tried to drop the dice so they land on twelve. Oh, okay, honey. Well, that would be cheating. <laughs> A law of Jumanji hadn't been broken. You will slip back even more than your token. Peter, your hands! Look at your hands! Shut the f*** up. What is this about? I know you know. Yes, I do. But you wouldn't believe me even if I told you, Carl. I know you used to work on the stamping line at Paris Shoes. Until old man Paris fired me. And I had something I could have turned this whole town around. Get us. It's me, Alan. Whoa! Got the f up. You just saw three monkeys go by in a motorcycle, didn't you? I mean, it don't matter. You got a little wolf boy with you. <laughs> and he got zebras and everything there. Oh my god. Give me that. Oh, hey. Hey, he f***ed up. He just left him there. That should do the trick to anything. Oh, yeah. Ah. Ah. Hey, my back up to beat him. Great ah. Jack. Ah. Look how big that f***ing scope is, man. There. I'll let you go. Now what are we going to do? You are gonna stay. Those are my keys. Those are my keys. Hey, my handcuff keys. Wait. This is something I have to do. Hey, he's having a horrible go at it. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> For him to be a hunter, bro, his shot is terrible. What is he doing? <laughs> Shut the f up. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Here's the game. Oh, why he scream like that? Stop your cringing, woman. I could have shot you at any moment. Then why didn't you? You didn't roll the dice. Alan did. I apologize. Talk about your aim, sir. He should be here any moment. Yeah. Ain't that his pop star? So remember. I forgot about her. Oh, shit. she better go see her house, ain't she? Monkey got her. Shut the f up. You don't cry, all right? You keep your chin up. Come on, keep your chin up. <laughs> Crying never helped anybody do anything, okay? Hey, what? What? You have a problem? You face it like a man. And he need, he need a class on how to talk to kids. Remember what you told me? It's all right to be afraid. It's not that. What is it? What is it? Don't worry. We're gonna have you turn back into your old self. Shut the f*** out! Suddenly I feel right at home. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Give me some back. <laughs> Lorraine? Rain gone, folk. Can I have a ride home? Where do you live? Jefferson Street, the old parish place. Do you have children? A boy and a girl? Oh, yes. Yeah. Get in, I'll explain it all on the way. Hey, bro, you better get got. What kind of sound he make? Where do you live? <laughs> See? If he wanted to stop to pick up that hitchhiker, he'd still have his car. We gotta get to that house. Whoa. Another lesson in not oh, oh, why not to pick up hitchhikers. Every month at the quarter moon, there'll be a monsoon in your lagoon. Yeah, well, at least we're inside. <laughs> like that stopped anything else from happening. Well, at least we inside like monkeys rhinos you know what i'm saying like we see her with wolf boy the inside gotta do with it hello rain never hurt anybody yeah but a lot can kill you like can't i just like can't the next person just instantly roll the dice Judy! Alan? shut the f up Hey, bro, you was dressed like the Crocodile Hunter. Can't you fight it? Ah! He'd have got that homemade chocolate, baby. I'd have doo-dooed all in his mouth. Ah! Uh -uh. Oh, I didn't know it was more than one of them. That gate about to hit him with the death row. Judy! Peter! Uh, ma'am, you step back and let me handle this, please? Hey, bro, you, you've been having a horrible go at it all day long, don't... I always wanted to do this. Could you step back, please? <laughs> oh, my God! That's funny as hell. Hey, hey man, his white socks is the funniest part to me. You okay? Yeah. I just thought about it. They all got on. Ooh, they all got wet socks. Ooh. Alan, you wrestled an alligator for me. I mean, he used to get jumped for you. He's a uh -oh. crocodile. Alligators don't have that little 
fringe handling. Come on. Shut the f up. My mistake. Hey, um. So that line somewhere wet and pissed off, ain't it? Beware the ground on which you stand. The floor is quicker than the sand. Okay. Help me. Okay. Oh, he go. Grab on. Okay, I got it. She is eighty-five pounds. Come on. There is a lesson. All right. So they do roll. You still gotta go through your hell. There is a lesson you will learn. Oh, I got you. Sometimes you must go back a turn. So it's your turn, Peter. Okay. Now they had to go back a turn. Would it make his turn again? Need a hand? Why you just wait? We'll help you out. We each have eight. Listen. What's that? If it was any time to go, it'd be now. Hey, I bet she tripping balls. <laughs> oh, he's a monkey. I am so slow. I've been calling him a little wolf boy. Even after I seen the steel. <laughs> Jordan, shut the door. Shut the door. <laughs> it's been there chilling on the bed. It's your turn. You can finish if you roll a seven. I can't roll. Put the dice in your mouth. Judy. Oh, she's gone. Judy, are you okay? No. <laughs> oh, she's gone. Foot, foot. Ah! Ah! It was ugly. Her only chance is if we finish the game. It's ah! Oh, my God. Ah! Oh, that's not an earthquake. That's something different. I mean, how you get out the room? Well, never mind. It is an earthquake going on, so. Don't move. Bro, roll the dice. Stand up. I don't open my hands, oh fans. Drop it. Aren't you afraid? I'm terrified. My father told me. I mean, this dice is gone for a long time, ain't it? Face what you're afraid of. Good lad. You're finally acting like a man. Any last words? Jumanji. Um, the Jumanji. Now what happens? No, Alan, no! <laughs> Get that gun, man. <laughs> so do it fix everything or do it leave everything f***ed up? I wish you to kick them. Shut the f*** up. Oh, you are bullshit. Was this like a dream? My speech notes. I'm so glad you're back. I've only been gone five minutes. Seems like a lot longer to me. Hey, I, I thought you told me you were never going to talk to me again. I'm sorry. Like, so he gets to go get his, his, his whole life back. Back in 1906, I mean, today in the factory, it wasn't Carl Bentley's fault. I put the shoe on the conveyor belt. So, so, do Carl Bentley get to make them Nikes now? Holy smokes, Judy and Peter! Alan! They're not there. It's 1969. They don't even exist yet. So... I have so many questions. <laughs> 
starting to forget what it's like to be a grown-up. That's okay. As long as we don't forget each other. Or Judy and Peter. Well, yeah. If the, the two little kids, when they were born, are, do they remember them? You kiss this bloody lip? Ooh. I want to see them growing up and see if they still together. So are they Judy and Judy and um Peter's um parents? Is that how this end up? Listen, Dad, I gotta run. Yeah, Merry Christmas. We'll pick you up tomorrow at the airport, okay? It'll be the best Christmas gift of all. Bye bye. Bye bye. Here. I wonder how many times he got his ass back in school. Glad you could make it. Thanks. Hi. This is my wife, Martha. Hi, Martha. Pleased this is you. Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Nice Where are the kids? Oh my god, there they are. How'd you know? Shut the f up. A guess, a guess. Of course, they're your kids. Well, they're you're right. These are our children, uh, Judy and Peter. Kids, say hi, hi to Mr. and Mrs. Parrish. Nice to meet you. Did they know? Did they... <laughs> Merry Christmas. Oh, look at this. <laughs> so the kids don't remember? Martha and I were thinking of taking a little uh, skiing holiday up in the Canadian Rockies. No! no! Sorry. We, we just... Need you to get that marketing done on the new line, pronto. <laughs> you know, I, I could probably start next week. That'd be great. Yep. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. I wonder how many Christmas lights that is. Kiss the sis a boy. That the f up. All right. We just got finished watching Jumanji. And I can't lie. That's a good-ass movie. It's a good, fun movie. It's one of those you can just turn on and just constantly enjoy it over and over and over. Um, it's got good action. It's got good comedy. Even got a couple little jump scares in there. My man wanted to run away. Technically, he ran away for 26 years inside the game. It was involuntarily, but still, same effect. First thing he did when he come back, he wanted to see his parents. They was gone. Got a second chance, got to go back. First thing he did, apologize to his pops. His dad loved him more than anything in the world. He was a mean fuck, but he, he loved him more than anything in the world. He did everything in his power to try to find him. He never did. Which would have to suck as a parent. Like, that has to be a horrible film. The Jumanji board is a petty ass board. It ain't shit. <laughs> we played the board game because, you know, we want to take a break from reality. Not get attacked by reality. Well, well not get attacked by the fantasy world. You know what I'm saying? Like, them motherfuckers. Giant mosquito bugs. Lions. Rhinos. Crocodiles. Floods. A hunter who got a... I don't, I don't know what kind of gun he had. That, hey, I want two of them. Can't lie. I enjoy seeing De David Allen Greer in here. I'm telling you, I haven't seen De David Allen Greer in anything since I was little. A living color and blank man. I don't think I know anything else this man is in. The only thing I've seen him in is Boomerang and living color in the army now and blank man. It said he was in four episodes of Martin. I ain't never seen him. I ain't gonna lie to you. I kind of wish Robert Williams Stay looking like he did when he first came out the game. I thought that would have been extra funny. I was kind of hoping, like, I don't know how that how it would have worked, but I was hoping that the kids remembered them. They had no idea what the hell they was talking about. And they saved those people's life. They saved those people's life. Like, nah, you don't need to go. We need you to start on the thing right now. I honestly like this more than I thought I was going to like. I'm going to get off here. Like I said, it's 2.45. I hope y'all enjoyed watching it with me. Glad y'all watching with y'all. Y'all didn't know it from me earlier. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the Patreon. Speaking of the Patreon, I want to shout out to the VIPs. I want to shout out to Leslie, Trey, John Harold, Becca June, the beautiful dog Missy, Big Al Robin, Big Frank, Pro Crow, Cody Stoudemire, Paul Swicky, Frost1997, Anna Rondo, Jeff Jernigan, 
Adam, Grady B. Olsen, Red Tail Z, TJ Gingler, Thomas, the Brandons, Garrett, Elizabeth Esposito, Nicholas Jenkins, Super Nobody, Rachel Martinez, Jennifer Natley, BB98, Chris and Irene, but yeah, Chris and Irene, Nick, Coke Movies at Midnight, Jamie Gibson, Miguel Brooks, Caleb, Steve McCluzo, Echo, Peanut, Sammy, Zachary, John DePatrick, Ron, Rocket, Beardo, Blackbeard, Bob, Hot Indie Media, Amen Lock, Jake Stimson, Benign Boar, Jake Slogan, Tony A. Aragon, Catherine Roberts, Dom, LeVar Hawkins, and Show. I want to thank all y'all for being VIPs. I want to thank everybody else for being part of the family as well. Um, tell y'all the time. I'm going to continue to tell you every video. Y'all the best part of this channel. We greatly appreciate y'all. So, y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Night, night.